What does it mean to be American? There are many different attributes an American citizen could have, but one of the most important is lending a helping hand when others are at their lowest. We've had big challenges in this country, and it's time to make sure that we pass a second relief funding bill that will address many of those concerns in the disasters that we've seen across the country. This attribute was apparent during the devastating fires California experienced in 2017 and 2018. Throughout these tragic losses, Californians showed the true meaning of being an American by putting their differences aside, by donating supplies, and giving up their time to help those suffering and struggling. Todo fue tan rápido que cuando salimos no sabíamos para dónde íbamos a ir. Hasta que una amiga me dijo, aquí hay un refugio donde nos pueden ayudar. To warm your spirits here, I want to introduce you to two-year-old Gracie handing out breakfast burritos to fire crews. In Eureka, California, three children sold lemonade to raise money for victims. Close to 4,000 inmates in California's prison system volunteer to fight fires. We talked to Stephen Walsh, the communications director for the Red Cross Gold Country region, and he explained what he saw during the devastating car fire. One of the days that I was at the shelter where I was working, uh, there was a young man that drove up in his car and his car was full of brand new pillows that were all wrapped up. And so he started unloading the pillows on his own and walking into the shelter to hand them out to people who might not have something soft to sleep on. Small acts of kindness like these truly make an impact on the lives of the people who lost everything. ...have finally returned home to find nothing but ash and rubble. You just never think it's going to happen to you. The true heroes that were behind the scenes from the natural disasters were the first responders and volunteers. It is uh, appropriate to recognize the heroic uh, acts of the men and women who who fight these fires uh, throughout the season. More than 13,000 firefighters are battling 19 major fires across the entire state. I've never thought we'd be sending resources out to California like this, but uh, this is if this is a unique situation out in California and those guys are, are tired and they, they need some help. Firefighters march up a ridge to make a stand against the approaching inferno. We talked to David Price, who is an engineer for the Consumers Fire Department in Elk Grove. He explained to us how the firefighter team relies on each other to stay alive, as if David makes one mistake, it affects the other people inside. But they're willing to risk their lives to help others. And in reality, we all like rely on each other. So I mentioned I'm the engineer. I have to get water to the firefighter who's on the end of the hose. And if they're inside the building um, and I make a mistake with my job, um, they could get into some serious trouble. We talked to Derek Cantar, who has first-hand experiences in the behind the scenes of the fires. Derek works for Caltrans Offices of Emergency Management, who is also the state coordinator of emergencies in the state and has been working every major wildfire since 2014. And the other thing was when people would have questions, they, they would see fires and they would see aircraft flying the big tankers, dropping the retardant, they didn't understand what was going on, so I was there to help them understand um, what they were seeing. Some of the, the more touching acts of kindness was when you would see a, a firefighter coming, coming out of the front lines carrying someone's pet. And then they would you know, give it to one of the animal handlers who was there, but um, it was pretty, pretty common to see firefighters um, looking after people's pets in the middle of, of their job. That was pretty outstanding. Even celebrities are doing what they can to help the fire victims. Celebrity chef decided to do something to help. Yeah, Guy Fieri set up his mobile barbecue to whip up thousands of meals for fire victims and emergency crews yesterday. The famed chef says it was the least he could do for his hometown. You know, those firefighters have been eating out of their, you know, their big lunch sacks. They get these big package meals, which are awesome, but nothing beats a hot meal. That's for sure. With nice. no end to the firestorm in sight, many say that they are grateful for help. The definition of being an American is a lot more than just living in this glorious country. 
The definition may vary from each citizen, as everyone has their right to freedom of speech, but to us, it is the selflessness that the people of this country have in time of crisis.